this project for those of you who don't know me i race dirt track cars on the weekend hey what's going on everybody welcome to crt motorsports first first vlog today we're going to be working on my truck it has a problem with the front suspension but we don't have the parts to fix it but part of the problem is because i have a three and a half inch no a three inch leveling kit on the front and the keys are cranked all the way up so it rides pretty rough and i got an alignment this is the only good tire that i have on the truck as you can see my back one is bald back here this was before i had the alignment and the other side this one just as bad on the inside even bad there and this is what i just noticed today on this one so not the alignment shop's fault just i don't have the right parts on the truck so instead of ordering new parts and fixing it because those these are brand new the ball joint broke off of that one back here just broke but instead of ordering new ones and spending a whole bunch of money on that we're just going to go back to stock and we'll probably just lower the rear because i'm not a big fan of the stock look and then after we get done with that because that shouldn't take us too long the shackles we're not going to do them today we don't have them today and yes i know the truck's dirty but this is the other project for those of you who don't know me i race dirt track cars on the weekend well i say dirt track cars i race my car on the weekend it's a dirt limited modified i just started racing last year um it was my rookie year last year i don't think we did too bad obviously this is a pretty difficult class to race with a lot of competition a lot of really good drivers in this class and we got fourth in points at 105 speedway and i think i was like the only rookie and like the top 20 in the points and i think in the south texas uh thing i'm not sure what it was but i think it was like 15th or 16th in points i'm not exactly too sure but we're getting ready for our 2022 season right now we just got done with our 2021 season and we got a whole lot of things that we need to do so with all this back here as you can see all this right here is going to get replaced don't mind this this is this is one of them we were in a hurry and you just needed to get it done but yeah let's get this truck knocked out and then we'll start working on the car for today Let me show you all this. In case anybody ever wants to or needs to adjust the keys like me, it's these bolts right here. This one and this one. You can see, I don't know why. This one's um sticking out a lot more than that one. You got to see that. I don't know why it does that. But I don't know. I put a tape measure on it. It measures the same, so I'm guessing that's good. But, like I said, I'm no technician. I'm just a guy who likes to work on cars. So let me get this taken care of real quick. We'll start working on the race car. as simple as that that does not look good at all well oh well too late now but yeah i took them all the way out you can see ow hit my head 
Let's see, I took him all the way out here and there. So let's see if we can get out from here and see if we notice any difference. Oh yeah, <laughs> big difference. I don't know if y'all can tell on camera, but I can definitely tell. Definitely, definitely tell. Now let's hope we don't rub. Right, let's start working on this. Probably need to get some a wet rag. Clean this up some. It has dirt and dust everywhere. That sand. We all race at Cleveland. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Yes, I have broken lots of bolts off in here. You know it's bad when you get good at removing them. So, yeah. There's one one night at the racetrack. I broke three off within maybe 20 minutes. Broke three, replaced three. So, yeah. It was pretty rough. It was a... Then we were like in a hurry to get things done. And because we were like trying to hurry up. Because we were like... About to roll up within the like next 30 minutes in staging lanes. But it is what it is. Live and learn. We'll get the right, we'll get the right tools eventually. Just like everything else. But there's one of our door panels. It probably looks a lot better than the one that's on the car now. There's another one shredded. Got cut in half one night. Oh, here's what we need. This is my daughter's toy. So yeah, that's why it's in here. But yeah, nonetheless, let's get this aired up. Get her aired up. Check it out. Roll it over here in the sun. Check her out. Oh. Yeah, I think it looks pretty good. Got the black of the wheel itself. And then the lip is red. And then got these. I didn't know whether to paint those or not, but I think I like the way it looks. Kind of goes with that color. Gray, red, and black. Matches perfect. This might as well be scratches. But, well, I guess we won't put that on today. We'll put it to the side somewhere. We'll put it over here a little. Oh, look, I can use this right now. All right, well, I guess let's grab the jack. Alright guys, let me find somewhere to set y'all. I'll go under there and start working on that. So we found something to set y'all on. No, I think we're ready. For now. Maybe. 
rezeki was in there pretty good Down one to go. One shot, guys. Now let's move to the other side, get the other one off. All right, well, now that that's done, I guess we'll set this down. See what it does. I've never set the rear end down without the shocks on there. Look, y'all check this out. See that door bar? I don't think that's supposed to be like that. Well, I know it ain't supposed to be like that. And that's when I got into that tire. Bent it right there. But, oh well. Try not to do it again. Filthy, 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 filthy. Maybe in our next video we'll clean her up a little bit. But, but yeah. So that being that, till next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you at the track, or we'll see you on our next video.